Quiero una cigarrillo. Buenas noches. <laughs> this is ASMR. And today I'm going to be showing you a couple of things that I purchased from my local art store that just popped up out of nowhere. I was so excited. Um, I immediately knew that I was going to go there today when I passed by, drove by um, before dinner this evening, and I was like, after dinner, we are going to that art store. Um, so I'd like to preface before I begin that obviously I have this beautiful microphone in front of me, and it's actually the microphone that I use to record my music. However, um, now I'm using it to record ASMR videos. I would have done it initially to begin with, although it was sort of out of order. It was only outputting sounds through one ear, so I thought that might have um, bothered some viewers. I, I know it would bother me, so um, I just didn't want to record with it at all until I fixed it, and I did, and it's working like magic after hours of troubleshooting. Um, so yeah. Um, right, so moving on. Before I begin, I just would like to mention that um, my older videos were recorded with this telephone <laughs> and so no longer going to use my telephone my cell phone for videos uh it's actually maybe the same quality with the photo view but um i will get better in quality in my videos and when i find my vloggy um which i haven't found yet um, i think there might be a thief involved i'm not sure i don't know where it is um but yeah my phone actually makes a similar quality to mine. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, lost me. Um, so, my love affair with art. Let me ramble about that a bit, if you don't mind. Um, so, what it is, really, is I've always been sort of very gravitated towards the arts. Um, I'm instantly stimulated with creative creating. <clears throat> so obviously, uh, you already know that I'm a singer songwriter. So this guy back here is <laughs> always taking the majority of my time. Um, literally maybe like hours I'll play or maybe the entire day no exaggeration um for my lately the focus has really been on the guitar but now I'm going to take it to the next level for me and go back to what I was originally very passionate about as well in the beginning most of my adolescence I drew a lot, I sketched, and that was mainly what I did, along with music too, but sketching and painting and all of that was sort of my, my way to um, show my individuali individuality and create. So, in the back of my mind, the sort of... Um, idea of creating again and drawing and sketching and painting was always a goal, but I just never fully tackled it. There was several instances where I would be, become very ambitious and I would purchase endless amount of art supplies and think that I'm going to be some famous artist. <laughs> and draw every day and that would be my thing and there was a few things that I did um, the 
nothing that I continued with. So this time I wanted to be a little bit more subtle with my approach, a little bit more conservative with my crazy, like, <laughs> I'm very impulsive and I needed to keep myself on check and sort of just purchase the basics this time around. Uh, so the first thing I purchased was this sketchbook. Also, my there's a lot of words right now, and I'm sorry. I just feel like that's what's going on. But yeah, sketchbook. It's a very um, durable hardcover. This is something when I actually really wanted. Um, want to always sort of have something I can sleep through when I draw and here it is it's new and fresh and crispy and I'm just begging to be brought to life my sketchbook. Um, it makes like a nice relaxing sound. Let me just like so I'm very excited with the sketchbook. Um can't wait to start drawing and it's going to be sharing a few stuff of my amateur sketches. <laughs> so that's the book. Yay. So excited. Okay. So I also got Dear Prismacolor, Premier, um, very thin light pencils. And I'm just gonna go ahead and open it up really quickly and show you guys what they look like. Show myself what they look like too. I'm really excited. So let's get this. Bear with me, guys. I'm sort of um, challenged when it comes to opening things. This isn't embarrassing. I'm just getting some teeth. <laughs> I'm so stupid, I can't do it. <laughs> okay, got it. Okay, Drew. 
these are the pencils. So the colors that I have here are, um, they're numbered. So we have BT734, which is white, I got yellow, an orange color, green, blue, or maybe it's sort of like a hunter green, and then blue. Uh, sort of light blue, I got purple, uh, orange, red, blue, and black. So those are the colors. And let's go ahead and open them up. Quite eagerly. comes with um, this be a part of the new prismacolor.com gather the most diverse set of distinctly different like minds ever assembled meet the trendsetters on the floor of thinking here to unveil your vision it's a community your peers await well maybe I'll check that out these are my new colored pencils yeah so excited for this like creation the god painting. Well, I should say like the creative process has now begun. I just really want to tap into drawing again. It's been ages and I just wanted something that I'd be happy doing and I also have this sharpener that I half opened and realized it got open in front of everybody else. So it's a really cool sharpener. It looks like almost like a bullet. And it's metal. And it's looking a lot like the other. that wasn't cool um yeah but it looks like a bullet let me sharpen one let's do a wreck and then I'll do a serious my dog might be whimpering any moment now he's dreaming and he cries in his sleep. Poor baby. Awesome. It looks so weird. It's reversed. I'm actually left-handed. So it might look weird that I'm writing on this side. happy face. I don't know if you can see. Okay, so I purchased two other things. I got these two pencils and um, since we're listening, I really like the texture of it. It's not so much, but it has a really good grip. Um, first drawing sketch I got is 4B and this one is 6H and I tested these out earlier and I'm just going to show you the different sort of consistency that things each have so this is the uh, 4B I'm 
this is the uh, six inch. Looking at upside down. Six H. <laughs> yeah, it's like a four. Six and a half size is kind of like a nine. So it is one twenty five size maybe. So that's everything we got today. <clears throat> I hope you guys found this video relaxing. I, you know, maybe I look a little bit too excited in the video. No new surprise. But, um, hopefully you still found that a tad bit relaxing, I hope. Um, that is it. I'm gonna sign off until next time. I have some surprises or videos for you guys this week. Um, and if you have any requests, just let me know. I know there was a few that I got, which I'll get around to. I'm all about, um, doing the requests for you guys and sort of like a paper paper. So, um, I'll get around to it. Um, I think there's like a Clover Whisper video and, um, another just regular whisper and I will ramble and some role plays and yes. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed you are going to have a very good sleep tonight um don't forget to recharge and reset your body and have a better day tomorrow and have a great day tomorrow because we're so relaxed tonight um and